Wizards, eh? Today we're trying, what are we doing? Chocolate! Butler's chocolate! Chocolate! Are you chocolate fans? Huge! Yeah. Chocolate can't, fans. Can't not be. Oh my goodness. I love chocolate. Love me some chocolate. Love Butler's mm -hmm. chocolate. Mm -hmm. Butler's is great because when you go in, you order a coffee, they give you a little chocolate with it. They always give you one after you buy coffee. You can like choose. Yeah, and um, that is not always clear. And then suddenly somebody's you know, like, which one do you want? And you're like, what? <laughs> Irish Atlantic sea salt. Oh! Ooh, straight from the sea. It's a fancy blend. Butler's is the Ferrero Rocher of the chocolate world. Wait, <laughs> oh, wait. Is it Ferrero Rocher? <laughs> Ferrero Rocher is also the Ferrero Rocher of the chocolate world. It's gonna taste like a swim in the Irish Atlantic Sea. And for me, that is very literal because I cannot close my mouth when I swim. Wait, what? I really struggle to close my mouth when I swim. <laughs> You're fucking joking. I'm like, I am like Moby Dick, just like. <laughs> Sea salt and chocolate? Love yeah. it. It's a classic. <laughs> you it's love classic. sea salt. Oh, You're yeah. Drinking it all the yeah. time. Yeah, I'm going into, I'm just like sticking it in a bucket at the sea, <laughs> bringing it home, shoving my head in the bucket like I'm bobbing for apples. Mmm, <laughs> it's very decadent. It's very fancy. The good salt. Oh my god, I love it. Oh, I'm getting this. Chocolate. Mmm. Salt. Two mm. things I love. See, here's the thing about this kind of chocolate. It's so good, but I don't crave it. No. It's the in-between milk and dark. Like yeah. it's, it's definitely more teetering towards dark. 60%. But it's, yeah, it still has that mm. bit of a milky consistency to it, which is really nice. Is it a bit too salty for you? I wouldn't eat this whole bar. It's it's rich. Mm. It is very, very rich. I feel as if, if you're trying to be quote unquote, like good and not eat chocolate, you would have this because it would satisfy the urge for chocolate, but it's so rich and decadent, you can't actually eat that much of it. Yeah. I'm going to say it now, and if I jinx it, I jinx it, but I doubt. I doubt we're going to dislike any of these butler's chocolates. I also think that we're going to have ones that are even better than this one. Like, it's it's chocolate. Mm -hmm. We're going to have a good time in this video, that's for sure. Mm -hmm. And the thing is, is that like, so I w if I have to critique it, what I would say is, it's a little bit too salty. Too salty. I wouldn't get through the whole bar. Okay. You need well, so much water. <laughs> that, that, is, that is true, that is true. <laughs> to be honest with you, if they just dip this in seawater, they'd be able to call it. Yeah. Like there's not much to go, like you don't have to do much to make it an Irish Atlantic sea salt bar. No, all you have to do is get my bucket <laughs> with that water in it. Aiden's special bucket. <laughs> oh, now we're in, now we're in. Crispy. Oh my God, this is gonna be amazing. No, this is gonna be amazing. Do you mm. ever consider buying these? No, never. Me neither. Never. Why is no, that? It's not a thing. I think these are mainly for tourists to bring home. Are these on sale, Sean? Are they on sale? We're in no, a bargain just, bin. Uh, are they going off tomorrow? <laughs> in the shop normally. You're like, I've got to fucking find something for these losers <laughs> to eat. I love honeycomb. Is honeycomb a crunchy? Yes. I love it. My teeth hate it. Oh, yeah. My dentist financially loves it. Of but course. In terms of effort and output, hates it. Yeah, like you're, you're putting your dentist's daughter through college. Yeah, Samantha, I'm proud of you. <laughs> See you at your graduation this year. You can do communications if you want to. <laughs> you don't have to be a dentist like your parents. <laughs> you beautiful bastard. The milk, the chocolate, after coming from like the salted one there. Mm -hmm. It's so different in chocolate flavor. It's so good. I like all the little bits. Mm -hmm. It gives a nice little crunch to it. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm kind of regretting it now because it's just a lot happening. It's too much anyhow. Yeah. Mm. I'm starting to get irritated again. <laughs> you won't like her when she's angry. Mm -mm -mm. And she punched a seagull yesterday. <laughs> oh my! Like, it's light milk. Mm. Like it's it's like a it's borderline between white chocolate and milk chocolate, mm. isn't it? It looks like it's very indulgent and luxurious. Uh, like you know, like when you see those like Lindor or Lint ads, and like the the chocolatier like slowly dripping the stuff down. <laughs> it's just like that. It's very upper class. I love that guy. You should do the ad for it. <laughs> just, see, doesn't this make you want to eat chocolate? <laughs> see, right there. You should work for them. Eat if you're chocolate. watching, hire this woman. <laughs> see, I want chocolate already. Irish cream liqueur. Oh. Liqueur. Ooh. Liqueur? I, I hardly know her. <laughs> I feel as if they're they're really trying to insinuate from the colouring and the packaging mm. that this is Bailey's and it's kinda of like we got Bailey's at home. Yeah. And then then you're like, it's chocolate. <laughs> this is just generic Irish cream. This is kind of truffle. Is it truffle as well? And truffles. Oh my god, oh. This, oh, this is gonna be so good. Yet again, they're 
easing into the whole Irish cream, you know, the Irish stereotype yeah, thing. Yeah, you know? I think you're right with the touristy thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very much aimed at the tourists and not the Irish people, because mm. I, for one, have never bought a bar of this. No, and I wouldn't. Do you like cream liqueur? I can't drink it. Really? Why? I'm lactose intolerant. Oh, yeah. You can't either. That's the loop. 0.17% alcohol. <laughs> We're getting locker doodles <laughs> off chocolate. Could you imagine? Uh, how We're many... getting locker doodles. I would need to eat 170 squares of this in order to feel something. Yeah. So, I mean, let's get going. Challenge accepted. I like Bailey's a lot. And I like mm -hmm. like cream liqueur, mm -hmm. right? A lot. You hardly know her. And <laughs> <laughs> my, my gag. <laughs> Sorry. It's crumbly. No, but how? Oh, it does have a twang of. No, but how does that how is that how is that alcohol? That's mind blowing. Oh yeah, you can mm. taste that. Oh my god. I love it. Do you? I do. My That's brain. a very alcoholic take. So I've, you usually with alcohol chocolate, it's either chocolate like, encasing like actual liquid, or it's kind of blended in, and you can't really taste oh, the alcohol. This is chocolate. This is it's alcohol. This yeah. Is, oh my god. It's very, in, it's very, very, very indulgent mm. and rich, isn't it? I think it's too much. <laughs> It's I don't deserve this. <laughs> Imagine if this was all just, like, sometimes I wonder, you know, because like everyone, everyone kind of like perceives reality in the own way. Like nobody really experiences reality because like we're just like a brain connected to a body and a body can't be with a brain, a brain can't be with a body and you never can fully, you're basically telling a narrative through everything you see and feel and making sense of it. But I just sometimes wonder, is anything I'm doing real? And is this just like a weird, and then when I eat something that reminds me of something that actually happened in my, my real life outside of here, I've said too much. Oh my, this 0.17% alcohol and these are the conversations we're having. Irish whiskey. Irish whiskey, dark chocolate. I feel like they're going to do it well. Oh. It also, it does look like a present. Yeah, it, it's, it's gorgeous. It's, it's a gift to us, this try shoot. I actually prefer dark chocolate you, to milk chocolate. But would you gorge yourself on it? Yeah, I feel, really? like, I feel like it's easier to eat and lighter. But that's because I don't really like very, very sweet things. Right, okay. I like the bitter milk. Mm -hmm. oh, you like life bitter. I am a sour tart bitch. <laughs> um, oh, we're up to 0.26. Okay, I'm gonna see God. Yeah. <laughs> Oh no, no, it's there. Holy flipping Nora. There's a man, his name's oh Jameson. He's knocking on the door. Jamie is there. Holy Nora. Bang of whiskey off that. Oh yeah, you can mm. taste that whiskey. Wow. It's actually like very impressive the way that they've managed to pack so much much of the flavor in there. It holds a punch. Mm. You know the theme song from uh, Hannah Montana? Best of both worlds. Uh -huh. This is the opposite. It's the worst of both worlds. <laughs> it's the worst of chocolate and the worst of whiskey put together into one. Even when you chill out, take it slow. You can't rock out the show? We can't rock out the show. Oh. Put them all together and you know it's the worst of both worlds. Yeah. What in the, how? How? I that feel like I just took impressive. a shot. You can absolutely taste mm. the whiskey in that now. The whiskey they have in here has a strong taste to yeah, it. Yeah, absolutely. Mm. So if you had a melted pint of that. You would vomit everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> You'd need to have 20 pints of that melted to equate one beer. Wow. Don't Don't, do, do not Don't drink do 20 pints of this melted down. Don't do Please. It. Is it very whiskey? Yeah, but not like the good part of whiskey, which is like the flavor and being drunk and, and bonding. It's the worst of whiskey. The fighting. Yeah, and the disagreements. And the hangovers. And the fear. Yeah. This is one that like, I don't think you'll be able to finish a full no. bottle. You'll be spitting this up with your family yeah. maybe. Yeah. Whilst the other one, I would happily nibble away on that. Hide it from the in family in your corner. <laughs> don't come near me. This is me on my own. Hey, you All right. tried different bullets, chocolate. What do you think overall? Hey. Well, Sean, what do you think? <laughs> Uh, me, I you try 40 the photos. <laughs> <laughs> I will say I am whelmed because of how much I liked the uh, uh, honeycomb and the cream liqueur. I've never had the bars, so for my first experience with the bars, I'm now in a predicament of what am I going to purchase now next mm -hmm. time I go to Boulders. That's Just me now. No yeah, more that's chocolate for today. Done. That's me. No more chocolate for at least a year. <laughs> well, no, I'll have some chocolate tomorrow. Like <laughs> <laughs> Your daily fix of Butlers. I'll eat some chocolate tomorrow for sure. <laughs> Actually, Joe, you know I'll probably have some chocolate tonight. <laughs> when you get home, you know? It won't be Butlers though. Will it not? No. Hi guys, thanks for watching this video. We reacted, we liked, we hated, we learned and we loved. If you learned and loved a lot from this video, like the video, hit the bell, subscribe. And if you have a butler, you are rich and shouldn't be watching this channel. 
Go fuck yourself. That was beautiful.